welcome to 4 one issue number 9. We're here at the Rose Parade, New Year's Day. I uh, hope you enjoy this issue. This issue we have Andy Stone profile. We also have the industry section which is Sonic. We have the Nuber contest, we have the Monster Mash contest, and we also have the uh, Love Park contest. Enjoy those. A retrospective of New York City. We have a spot check at the HB Skate Park. In this issue, we have Wheels of Fortune with Drake Jones and Anthony Correa. We also have uh, little Stevie Williams and Josh Callis and your friend Shani Jogana. And uh, where are you going? <laughs> I think that's all. Jones. Where are you at? I'm downtown San Diego. What are you doing? I just came in from San Francisco. Do you still ride for real? Yeah, I still ride for real, Spitfire, Indian Vans. 
What's, are you still going to come pick me up? Who are you with? Yeah, I'm with Josh Taylor. We're about to go to the brick. Meet us there. All right, thanks. You going to pick us up? Yeah, let's go. I think everybody from Pulaski, Love Park, New York, Philly, Florida, the West Coast, wherever they're from. That's it. Well, Stevie's out. Cat.
double rider trick tip edition. We have toy machine rider Jamie Thomas and prime rider Chris Markovich. The trick is going to be a backside 50-50 down a handrail. Okay. First, learn it on your local curve. And then, go to your local handrail at your local school and do it. Thank you. Thanks a lot for coming out. Bye. <laughs>
get your motor running. Head out on the highway, looking for adventure. And whatever comes our way. Tell you about a trick, it's called the Randy Roads, man. Take two skateboards, stack them one on top of each other, you ride the top one, and you just kick flip the top one right off the bottom one, and the bottom one disappears, just like Randy Rhodes did off the face of the earth, man. You just do it, you wave your brothers, you go, hey, what's up, Ozzy? And you just kick it down, man, just like that.
everybody this is my man Anthony Korea Skateboards. He used to live in he used to live in New Jersey, but now he uh, resides in Houston, Texas. This is crazy, it's wacky, it's wild. Let's get out of here. Alright. Uh, Cut, that's it. That's a wrap. New York City. Well, where to start with the Metro File 411 video magazine? New York City, sum it up in a sentence in a four minute voiceover narrative video segment. It's a little difficult to do. Spend years here, not even know your own neighborhood. You don't pay attention. But shit is real. And all the skaters, all the people here know what time it is, most definitely. Um, there's been a lot of good things happening within the last two years in New York for skateboarding, for industry for everybody. Saw the emergence of New York looking out on a grand scale. Rodney doing his thing. Shout outs to everyone there. Got some new shops that popped open, that opened up. Got a new shop Supreme. Matt, Matt McGrath came over from San Francisco, set things up. Got Giovanni, Chappie. It's all good. Uh, we got Benji doing his thing. He moved to a new store down on Chambers Street, Ultimate Journey. He's got the records going on. If anybody comes to New York and is looking for some classics, Benji's got all the Motown shit, all the Jackson 5, kid. New York's rad because uh, it's kind of a central meeting place for skaters from all over the place. You got basically everyone who's skating in New York is a tourist. You've got kids coming in from New Jersey, from Connecticut, from all over New York, the other boroughs, upstate. So you got all these this mix of people coming in, and the, you know they're meeting at the banks or at Astor Place or wherever, and they're skating the city, and uh, that's, that makes the scene rad. That's 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 what skating's about: traveling around and skating with other people, you know. Skating in New York's a lot different than skating everywhere else. It's not like California, that's for sure. You know, it's, it's, it's a whole different ball game, man. It's, uh, it's more about gigging, it's more about fun and friendship. And if you want to go say keeping it real, yes, that, that's, that's definitely what they're doing. Um, but shit is more about life, you know? Skateboarding is a part of everyone's life here. Shit is going on here. Industry's starting to build. Getting a lot of coverage from the West Coast. It's good looking, it's about time. You know, trying to keep shit real, fun, friendly. A little bit of politics going on, but I think that's, that shit is gonna be dead real soon. We got Zoo York, we got Brooklyn Boards, we got Ultimate Journey, Supreme. We got some other companies from around the way. They're not necessarily in the city, but 
definitely deserve props for the support. Screw skateboards, dead ends, all the heads that skate in Jersey, Connecticut, Pennsylvania, Long Island. People are ripping number nine. Nobody skates like the skaters in New York. Skaters in New York are the best. They're just, they got the most heart, and that, you can't question that. You, you come to New York and, and you test. You test. See, see who's got heart. Yo, one love to Steve Douglas and the 411 crew. We out. We just like to say that New York is in the house. Metro File, 1994. The winter's coming, but we're going to be skating. We're going to be keeping it underground. And you're going to witness some serious shit. California, California, watch out. Signature shoes. Styles available for all occasions.
Welcome to another edition of Spot Check. I'm your host, Skip Pronier, coming to you live from one of Huntington Beach's newest creations, uh, what looks to be a skateboard park on the campus of Huntington Beach High School. Built at the end of the summer, 94. Just opened up, and uh, let's have a look and see what it's got. Well, we're here at one of the most probably used and abused common items of the street area, the bench. As you can see, pretty standard bench, cement, and slippery. Let's move over to the rail slide. Not too far from there, as you can see. About a foot and a half high. About 12 feet long. Made of steel. Over here, we have the pyramid, or a fun box, as some like to call it. I just call it a pyramid because it's not all that fun. It doesn't really look like a box, either. So it's just your basic pyramid. Square and bank. Here we have the every so popular manual island coated with wax and very grindable. Just not too far from here, we have a bank that, as you can see, goes through the middle of the park and is a little short and quick. Now, there is one last item, and I do caution you. It's a bit scary, and it's taken some people down. It is the roller coaster. 
As you can see, it goes from high to low, and it's not square, it's round. And very dangerous, so I caution you, if you do want to assault it, do so with the most caution. Please be careful and have a good time. Just hanging out. Yes, I 
figure. I tell them, sell them, style that break them, soon to make them. No, I'm the man and no more faking. The thought taking the junk back. I'm breaking it down for clowns, cause you whack. I'm never changing, forever ganging. My thoughts combined in my mind, so things you brought are the kind of prank I ignored you for. So stop. I see only one way there and prolific crews. We got the rough. I see your bluff. I get enough of the butt cuts and weaker stuff. Extra pros next to your sex and hope X and more niggas from the past at last neglecting those on stage like this. Now throw your hands in the air when you see me there, you reminisce of how you wanna be where I am. But never gonna be there I am. I'm at the top, I can't stop, keep the list. What's your name, bro? Andy Stone. Who do you skate for? Company. Element. Adventure, nicotine, and fans. Cool, is good? That's dope. Right. Just tight. Where you from? Washington, D.C. Where are you go there? Uh, yeah. Where do you like to skate at? Mostly here, but like... Where here? Philly. <laughs> and New York. And Cali in the, in the cold times. Where? Yeah. Is it a dope scene? It's dope. Cool. I know what else to say. <laughs> Ain't nothing else to say. Stop it, stop. Alright, that was issue number nine. Hope you enjoyed it. Issue 10 of 4 and 1 will be out in about two months. We'll check you there. Um, see you later. I'm the one for you. Just me, love.